light on and on and on and off and brighter and darker. Hi, I'm Oliver. Welcome to my smart home journey. Over the years I have built a smart home around automating my lights. You can find details about my smart light system on my blog or in the description below. Overall it works very well turning on and off lights automatically via motion sensors and even dimming lights over the day. Sometimes you still need manual control though. I mostly use voice assistant or the home assistant app for that, but sometimes a physical interface is just a better solution. I have tried buttons and even a smart light switch with a dimmer, but recently I found a small device that is uniquely suited for this kind of use case, a small Zigbee dimmer, a so-called smart knob. This small device, around 4 by 3 centimeters, connects to your smart home wirelessly via Zigbee and runs on a small CR2032 coin cell. There's a button in the middle as well as a rotating ring on the outside, which can both be used for controlling other web devices. The physical build quality is nice and everything works well and has no obvious issues. It even has a very strong magnet inside, allowing you to stick it to any metal surface nearby. There's also a metal base plate you can screw to the wall to mount it. I wish the control ring on the top would be made from some kind of metal though. It's just plastic which makes it feel a bit cheap. It moves around very smooth though and both the button and the ring have a nice clicky feeling. Pairing the device was really easy with ZHA and the Sonos Zigbee stick that I am currently using. You have to remove one small screw on the back to get access to the battery and a small reset button. There's a small needle included which you can use to click this button for a couple of seconds until the LED next to it starts blinking. If you also click the Add Device button in ZHA at the same time, the smart knob should show up after a couple of seconds. Once paired, the smart knob shows up in Home Assistant as a very simple device. In my case, it only shows the current battery percentage. Any interactions, like clicks or rotating the knob, show up as events only. You can now use the knob in any automation and it will show a lot of new options like left or right rotations or simple click. For me, some of those did not really work properly, but there is a great blueprint from the user Seamus65, link in the description, that allows you to easily pair the smart knob with any dimmable light. Now a click toggles the light on or off, a rotation dims it up or down slowly, and a rotation while pressing the button will actually dim it up or down faster. Very neat. You could of course also use the same knob to control shades, heaters or basically anything else. That is the power of a smart home. So what is my conclusion? The knob is a well-made small device which will last a very long time due to Zigbee. In my case it's still on 100% after about a month of usage. Being able to mount it to any metal surface is neat and the usage feels very natural. You can just quickly turn on or off lights or find exactly the right brightness level. On the other hand, it also costs a bit more than 20 euros, which seems a bit too much for the materials used. I would have loved a more premium feeling ring made out of metal or something else. I also have to mention that it seems like the knob is not continuously sending updates while you rotate it. Only once you stop it will actually send the update. One small or one longer rotation seems to mostly result in the same brightness. I assume though that this is a limitation on the Zigbee level to conserve energy and honestly it did not really stop me from using it at all. Overall I would say if you don't care about the price too much then this is a great addition to your smart home. It works very well with Home Assistant and ZHA and it adds a very intuitive method of control to your setup. Let me know what you think about this device in the comments below and follow this channel for more updates and interesting projects in the future.